man charged with shooting another man at the Oñate statue protest at Española was on federal investigators' radar years ago. Looking to keep Ryan Martinez behind bars through trial, prosecutors revealed that and other new information about what they say Martinez told police after the shooting. News 13's George Gonzalez explains. Mr. Ryan Martinez. 23-year-old Ryan Martinez appearing again in front of a Rio Arriba magistrate judge this morning, days after a shooting in Española. Martinez faces charges of attempted murder and aggravated assault for shooting a protester near the spot where a Juan de Oñate statue was said to be reinstalled in front of the Rio Arriba County offices. Prosecutors are arguing to keep Martinez behind bars while he awaits trial, a decision that a magistrate court judge didn't make today. This court no longer has jurisdiction over your case, and now it will be transferred to district court for further action. But we now know how prosecutors plan on arguing their cases to a district court judge, saying that Martinez admitted to police that he, quote, attempted to commit murder when pointing his weapon and opening fire at Jacob Johns. Prosecutors also revealed the tweets made by Martinez dating back to 2018. According to court documents, those posts prompted the FBI to investigate Martinez and interview him in 2020. The feds say they warned Martinez about making threats. Today, his attorney tried to argue for his release from jail. As of 11 o'clock this morning, it had not been filed. They failed to meet the 24-hour deadline. We'd asked the court to set conditions of release. But the judge denied the request. George Gonzalez, KRQ News 13. Court documents indicate prosecutors are considering the possibility of other charges against Martinez, including reckless driving after the shooting, even possible child abuse for the shooting.